Welcome back to another Ping Pong Flicks Tinfoil Edition. This rumor is coming from We Got This Discovered. They are still talking about James Gunn taking over the DCEU. And today's news from them, this huge rumor, is very interesting. It appears their sources are saying that Warner Brothers is looking at James Gunn to reboot the Justice League. That's right. As part of the whole plan to reshape the DCEU, they're tapping James Gunn to reboot the Justice League. And they've been informed the team lineup consists of Batman, Superman, Batgirl, Black Canary, Wonder Woman, Aquaman, Flash, and Green Lantern. And as they've been talking about before, that Robert Pattinson's Dark Knight will break away from established canon with the DCU being split into two separate continuities moving forward. Now, I'm not sure if this is true, but let's just looking at these possibilities of James Gunn taking over the Justice League. As we all know that factually, James Gunn is taking over what they're calling the Suicide Squad sequel or reboot. Now, being that Warner Brothers is very reactionary, we can probably safely assume that if the Suicide Squad does critically and financially well, Warner Brothers is going to give more projects to James Gunn to tap into. And maybe one of those projects could be Justice League. Now, whether you like it or not, James Gunn is a close friend to Zack Snyder, as they've worked on Dawn of the Dead before, and James Gunn and Zack Snyder have praised each other before. So could it be possible that if James Gunn were ever to come into the DCU in a more permanent state after his Guardians of the Galaxy 3, that he could possibly bring back Zack Snyder as well? Could he maybe let Zack Snyder do other movies like Cyborg, another Justice League, Flashpoint, something like that, another Superman movie? And you never know, James Gunn may just bring back Henry Cavill, Ben Affleck, Gal Gadot, Jason Momoa, Ezra Miller, and Ray Fisher to reprise their roles for his Justice League reboot. Just like he did for the Suicide Squad movie where he brought back Margot Robbie, Joel Kinnaman, Viola Davis, and Jai Courtney to reprise their roles they played in David Ayer's Suicide Squad movie. That's a hopeful thought indeed. But in any case, if James Gunn's The Suicide Squad is very successful critically and financially, we could probably be seeing James Gunn do a lot more DCEU movies from here on forth. And that is all for tonight's rumors and speculation. Please join me next time on the next Tinfoil Edition.